I think it's marvelous. Allow me. Thank you. I've been wanting to meet you, both of you, for some time now. I thought it might be rather fun. Everything's possible. I think it'll be wonderful. I mean, we're practically family. Just call me Oedipus. I've had my eyes on you, you know. Really? It's been rather fascinating. Well, usually. I, too, have been waiting for this, this meeting. I knew there was no avoiding it. I've just been waiting and planning. Now, I've always found myself to be resourceful. I can usually make use of things around me, but I found it rather hard in this situation. My, you look lovely. Thank you. I'm so glad you finally got here. I'm sure you'll enjoy yourself. Now, where was I? Help me out here. You had just crawled out of the burning wreckage. Oh, so I... Oh, hello. <sighs> My, aren't we quick? I could have, or rather should have been quicker. Yes, I see. So I raced from the embers in barely enough time before it exploded. It was all so dramatic. A bit over dramatic, I'd say. Would you get my cigarettes, please? You've got the matches. No, please, get away from me until I need you. What are you doing? It's okay. I don't mind. You let yourself be treated this way? It works both ways. I know he'll call me when he needs me. It's okay. You pompous bastard. If you can get what you want, why not take it? And if you can't get what you want? I don't usually think about that. You're so rude and insensitive. Perhaps, but at least I know how to have a good time. At the expense of others. At least I have the others to be with. Well, I have places to go, people to see, and all that. Places that need me and people I need. Bye. So you see, I didn't expect any enjoyment from this situation. And now that we're together, I'd rather just get it over with. A bit defeatist, I'd say. No, not really. I think I see things all too clearly. Well, maybe that's your problem. See, I thought we'd all get together and have a nice time. You know, tell a few stories, have some laughs, kind of like a picnic. It's so much fun. I don't know why we couldn't have done it sooner. It just seems our schedules conflicted too much. I've been so busy. I haven't had time to do anything like this. I think it's wonderful. Let's play a game. <laughs> I don't know. It won't hurt. It'll be fun. Oh, all right. I'll go first. Guess what I am? What is that? It appears to be some sort of animal. A dromedary, I'd have to say. Nah. It was just a horse. But it was a great horse. I'll go next. Okay, just try and guess what I am. The Eiffel Tower. No, no, guess again. The Taj Mahal. No, you'll never get it. It's the personification of man's inhumanity to man. What? It's a sort of feeble attempt to show the bourgeois ideology vis-a-vis -vis the proletariat majority. I don't get it. It's a kind of class struggle for domination that tends to lead a society to revolution. You guys! But when one realizes one's overt mechanical structure in relationship to one's primitive psychological desires, the whole situation becomes extremely detrimental. I guess I just kind of look at things a little differently than you. We're all entitled to. Some things just don't want to work out. But we can always try. We'll see. What about you? What were you planning to do with us? I wasn't planning anything. Nothing? Nope. And that's what was going to make this such a good challenge. Oh, tell us another. You're always so funny. I don't know. Oh, go on. 
Oh, all right. Okay, so once there was this man from Alabama. He had this daughter, see? And her name was Dottie, and she had fewer eyeballs. He told us that one already. Tell her something else. Oh. Okay, okay, so once there was this girl from Mississippi. What's your fascination with the South? How about a little variety? Okay, fine, forget it. I'm sick of telling jokes. Why don't you just leave me alone? Sure, whatever you say. Call me when you're ready. Tell me another joke. You're always so funny. What's the matter? All out of joke? Hello? I've got this great one for you. There was this guy from Detroit. I'm not home right now, but if you'd like to leave your name, number... I guess it didn't turn out the way any of us planned. I'm glad it didn't. Yes, so am I. Do you think we could ever be friends? I don't know. Sure we can. Well, maybe. See, we're all so different. It's already obvious that we don't look at things the same. Maybe that's good. But I don't want to look at things alone. You don't have to. I suppose we can work off each other somehow. When we get stuck in a situation, look at it from another point, point of view. Give it more than one dimension. After all, we're not simple characters. characters. We're not puppets. We're individual people. We're complex and unique. You're you. And, and we're, we're me. me.